Correct, correct people, how are you guys doing? Good morning, afternoon, evening to you all according to your time and the time where you take this. See this video. Yeah, welcome back to Tessis TV and we are still on the gist about uh, waiting the sub for inside the palace of her own. Eh? My wonderful people, Olo Rito Biloba, as we are hearing, has been sentenced uh, for two years in prison. Yes. I'm not in normal prison, all my career people are sweet. They hear saying a cree cree prison where all of it's a little bit go spend the next two years in. Yes, she don't say that. And uh, who first called police the win case? Like I tell you now, she run, enter court, goes to KBS, goes to Queen Naomi. Say so Queen Naomi, they cause emotional damage for her. Queen Naomi, this Queen Naomi, that Queen Naomi, they have an affair with KBS. And we heard that uh, the lawyers took the matter up. When a woman lawyer was representing her, Toby Lover lawyer was representing her. And the matter, as we heard, has been ongoing till some days back, the final judgment was given. And as the final judgment was given, you know, Queen Naomi was found not guilty of all charges that was leveled against him by Olori Toby. And Olori Toby, again, was found guilty of all charges that... Uh, she labeled her against Queen Naomi because Queen Naomi is legally the wife of KBAC. As we heard, that she's still married traditionally to him. So there is no way she is having an affair with KBAC. There is no way she is causing an emo emotional damage to all the Olobis. So we heard that the lawyers gave their judgment and asked the Olobis to be about that she is going to publicly apologize to Queen Naomi. And since then, Olori Tobilova has not done that because we heard that uh, she is going to publish it on newspapers. Yes, she is going to publish her apologies on newspapers for people to see that she meant it. She refused and stood her ground. We heard that the court has to reverse it and uh, send Olori Tobi to two years in prison. That is what we are hearing. And no be normal prison, anyhow, prison yes say na two years in cray cray prison that uh, they gave her. And she was crying, my correct people, as we heard. She was lolling on the floor, begging the judges that she is ready now. She is going to plead Queen Naomi. She is going to publish it. They said, lie, lie. Yes, yeah, we gave you time to do this, which you refused. Up till now, you have not done that. So there is no way we are going to reverse the sentence again. You are going to be put behind bars. You are going to enter prison. And we heard that uh, Toby is crying, you know, calling Kabi still on phone, reporting you know, that is, she was creating a menace. She was creating menace in the court as we heard, pleading and begging everybody. Pleading and begging the judges that we are in charge of this case to temper justice with mercy. That she have a twin, she have twins to feed. She cannot just uh, enter the quickly prison. She cannot just even sleep in a cell for a day. That she have children to feed. And we heard that the judges told her that is the reason why they wanted to consider you. That the offense you committed is a punishable offense. Yes. You committed a punishable offense and we used because you are a nursing mother. We do not want to put you behind bars. We only ask you to go and publicly apologize to Kinawomi, which she refused. And for that, that you have to be jailed for this uh, defamation of character and everything that you guys has been causing to Olori Nawomi in the palace. Because like I tell you, Naseku Nawomi, she did pass through pain in that palace, but she's not the talking type. She loves keeping her space. She loves uh, keeping silence. She doesn't like to escalate matters. And the Oloris has seen it as uh, her weak point. That is why you see all these Oloris fighting with Naomi here and there, dragging her, calling out her name, suing with Naomi. Yes, for no good reason, for no just good cause. Kabi is still telling us, say one by one, say, Queen Naomi is still my wife. She's returning back. Yes, Kabi is still talking. Still, the Oloris say, lie, lie. That Queen Naomi don't already leave palace. 
Why will she return back? What is she the come palace can look for? Okay, Kabi C was going to the Lekki mansion to see Queen Naomi since you guys are chasing Queen Naomi out of Palace and the Oloris say lie lie that Kabi C should stop her visiting Queen Naomi. They started plotting different evils against Mommy Tedenikawa. Attacking her spiritually. So Queen Naomi said no, I have had enough. Let me go back to Akire where my parents are. That is how Queen Naomi left with the with her properties, with Prince Tadenika, or back to Akire. She even returned the key to the Lekki mansion, and Kabiesi said, no, I cannot collect the key from you. It is yours. You have to hold it. Anytime you want to go back to the Lekki mansion, you can still go back. And you don't enter the Oloris for eyes. Yes. Because anything work with a woman do like this, so they go like to them. Um, they get information. Say Queen Naomi don't leave making Lekki Mansion. They pack their things from palace to that Lekki Mansion. And Kabi is saying no girl allow them to enter there. Yes. They started crying. Say Kabi is no love us. Kabi is no they care for us. Kabi is you are shitting us. You know. They started welling. Like some people do call them the welling wellers. And that is what they are. Because anything will happen for palace they must well. Anything for where Kabi Esi do for Queen Naomi, they must well. Anything where Kabi Esi do for Prince Tedenika, well, they must well. That shows that they are the wedding wellers, especially Miriam. Don't get into a bit of her. Now, so then they were up and down and say, Kabi Esi, stop treating Queen Naomi like a queen. Kabi Esi, stop treating Queen Naomi as if she's special. And Kabi Esi made it straight to them. Queen Naomi is special. Queen Naomi is the love of my life. Queen Naomi is the mother of my son. So she... She deserves everything that she is getting from me. That is where all the problems started. Yes, before you know it, we heard that her uh, already told me she don't sue Queen Naomi, she don't sue KBSC. Sue both of them to court. Say they are causing a problem. They are, uh, Queen Naomi is bringing problem in their marriages. Queen Naomi is causing emotional damage. Queen Naomi, she is uh, a husband snatcher. You know, there is nothing where Queen Naomi never see. Drag Queen Naomi to court. Oh. The case started. Till right now, as we heard some days back, the courts gave the final judgment. Yes, because one thing we say, all of the to say that uh, she is going to win the case. Without knowing no be person where first call police they win case, like I always say. Last, last, who win case? Queen Naomi. Yes. Queen Naomi win all the cases. Um, all of the was found uh, guilty. They wanted to take it easy on her because she's a nursing mother. But due to she has refused that uh, she no go publish a public apology to Queen Naomi, they say, okay, two years in quick rapism for you, nothing less again. And we heard that Toby has been in the courts some days back, crying, rolling on the floor, begging them to please consider her, that she cannot leave her twins, that she is a breastfeeding mother. And so we they hear my correct people because this matter, Thank God say it don't end well that Queen Naomi is still triumphing. So my correct correct people are waiting there for inside the palace of Oni. I bet make kuna chuk my drug your comments at the comment section and do not forget to click on your notification bell to always get update from us about waiting this up for palace. And for my returning subscribers, I can never cease to appreciate all of you. You guys are the real MVPs. Thank you so so very much for always coming by to my channel and always stay tuned for more updates will be coming back to back as alleged.